Throughout history, a vast array of individuals who, for whatever reason, became figures idolized by their civilizations. Some even seen as godly-like figures, sentient, divine beings, whom upon their passage into the next life were believed to live on, often as deities, according to New World history. The most academically funded research practices in said preparations into the afterlife is undoubtedly that of the mummies found within ancient Egypt. The Valley of the Kings – impressive protective strategy against tomb raiders. Yet the list of similar protective practices is long. The Sphinx, even claimed as the protector of the pharaoh's pyramidal tombs by some, although we, like so many others, based upon a lack of evidence, is untrue due to the pyramids never having been proven tombs. Yet this theme of protecting the dead clearly permeated historians' minds, and, we suspect, this is due to its recurrence throughout history. The curse of Tutankhamun, yet another relative story deriving from Egypt, with mysterious goings-on during Howard Carter's incredible discovery of King Tut's tomb. Objects of interesting motivations would often be left with these important figures, not just solid gold death masks, thrones, coins, canes, and other jewels, but people of nobility have even been found buried within chariots, complete with eight horses sacrificed for the burial. We have also covered many other booby-trapped tombs, proof of the ancients' own beliefs in their own versions of the afterlife. Yet, unquestionably, the most unique, and due to it remaining unsealed, the most enigmatic of them all, lay still guarded by an equally unique terracotta army. For all soldiers carved to depict an individual man, and the quantum phenomenon interdimensional pigment, Han Purple, still visible upon many of this army. What makes this site so unique from all others is that an entire army, along with other baffling technology, guard a tomb clearly constructed over such an incredible amount of time and with such enormous effort. It must contain someone or something of unimaginable importance. Furthermore, as mentioned in a previous video, poison-tipped, inexplicably advanced compound crossbows have been found still laying in situ, protecting the entrance, though at some point coated in sediment, possibly why the terracotta army was found buried. Was this tomb pre-flood? Radar scanning technologies are advancing rapidly, and regardless of the Chinese strict forbiddance to enter the tomb, technology is finally allowing us our first look into just what exactly such an incredible display of power has been guarding for all this time. It's an investigation we find incredibly exciting.